Hi, hello, welcome to Absolute Instrument System. In this video, I will attempt to use the Svantec supervisor software to save our report templates. Okay, after I've start the uh, Svantec supervisor software, first come over to the data browser and go to catalog. Catalog is the place whereby the data results file are being saved. So this is the result file that I want to work on. So I'll double click on this result file. And this is the, the standard template that came with the uh, uh, software. So I have session header, instruments configuration, as well as logger results. Currently, the logger results are shown in graphical format. And let's say I wanted to add a um, table to this report. So in order to add table to this report, I'm going to add a panel over here, double click on logger results. And now I have two graphical display. So what I want is not two graphical display, but to display a table. So if I click on this, I will convert the graphical display into a table. So in my report, I have session header, instruments configuration, logger results. The first one is based on the graph, and then logger results. The second one is based on um, table. If this is the if this is the um, uh, template that I want, that I want, I have session header, instruments configuration, logger result graph, as well as table. I'm ready to save. This template. Save template. So let's call this sound level sound report template one. Okay, save. I can designate this as my default template, or I can if I want to share this template with somebody else, I can export this template. And sound report template, let's say. So it's been exported. Close it. So what does this template does for us? It actually facilitates um, the creation of reports and how we want the report to be uh, organized. So in this situation here, I've already created the template. And if I want to generate a report, I can either overcome over here to generate report or do a preview or do a report option. Let's say I do a report preview. So this will be the preview of the report. I have the information. It's all displayed. If I can save this document file. Do you want to save it? No, that's, that's a review. Okay, how do I export the data in Excel, I can select um, the whole uh, table and click on this uh, button over here. And I would have this um, Excel being generated and exported. So this is how I can generate the, um, the results into Excel format. Even save no, and that's it. Um, well, one thing I forgot to mention: when I have logger results, I can choose um, what are the um, things that I would like to have it displayed. Let's say I do not want to display maximum; I don't want to display peak. I can do that. Don't display maximum. Don't display peak. Uh, I can save this format. This um, this this list. Let's say by coming over here, save view settings, and leq only. Let's say okay. So, likewise, I can select leq only. Okay. Sometimes you may not have these uh, options uh, displayed on the right hand side. We can choose to hide it or we can
can choose to display it. So this is the button to choose to display or to hide the options. If I need to import the um, a template, then I will need to click on this button here, go to the folder. This is another template that I've created earlier. So click on the template and import. It's already imported. So I can change between you know different templates easily by picking the templates, apply the template, or set this as a default template. Okay. Um, we can at this point um, you know I've demonstrated how we can create a template, export it, import it, and as well as uh, um, creating the uh, uh, generating the the report in document as well as exporting it into Excel format. Thank you very much for watching.